Hello everybody. Um, I'm making this to try to clear up a little bit of confusion about which way is clockwise and which way is counterclockwise. I know on social media, a lot of these electroculture sites, uh, you get a lot of confusion. You got people ask a question, well, which way do I determine clockwise or counterclockwise? And you get people responding, oh, clockwise from the bottom up. If you're looking at the top, you want counterclockwise from bottom up. And it, it's too confusing. There's no reason to go in two separate directions and everything. This is real simple. Now, going back to my childhood, I was always taught when determining clockwise and counterclockwise, it's as if you're looking at the face of a clock on the wall and the hands move in a clockwise direction. So, question is, what is clockwise and counterclockwise? So, you would start with looking at the end that's closest to you, the face of the clock. Now, here's a little spiral that I made. I pulled it back out. Just so you can see, it's dirty down here at the bottom. It's clean up here at the top. Okay? Now, this is supposed to be a counter or a clockwise spiral. How I determine that is I look at the face, the end closest to you, and the spiral is going in a clockwise pattern. If I turn it around, here's the top end. Looking at the face, again, you want to look at the face closest to you, just like a clock. And the spiral still goes in a clockwise pattern. See it? Same thing with the spirals, the jigs. You look at the face, the end closest to you, and look at the spiral, and it's going clockwise. Now if I turn this around, again, you look at the end that's closest to you, and the spiral is still going in a clockwise pattern. Okay? Clear so far? Now here is a counterclockwise. Again, look at the face closest to you. Now the spiral is going counterclockwise. If I turn around and start at the top, look at the top again. This is key. You always look at the end closest to you and see which way the spiral is going as it travels away from you. Okay, you see how this one's going counterclockwise? Here's the bottom, again, counterclockwise. I think what's happening is, is people set these down or even like this, if you got it in your pot, and they look down from above, and right away your eye wants to go to the bottom, because when you were looking at it this way, your eye was starting at the bottom. So when it's this way, you always want to start at the bottom. Well, that's wrong, because looking at it this way, you're going at the end farthest away from you, towards you. Now you'll see that Yes, that is counterclockwise, but you're traveling in the wrong direction. You always want to go from the end closest to you and see which way the spiral goes as it goes away from you. Now, whether it's sitting on the table and starting at the top and then traveling away, it's still going clockwise position. You see? Now here's a side-by-side -side comparison, just so you can see. Clockwise, see how those spirals are angled? Now here's a counterclockwise. See how the spirals are going the opposite direction. They're tilted opposite away the counterclockwise is, or the clockwise is. The angle doesn't change whether you're looking at it this way or if you turn it around. See, the angle is still at the top leaning towards the left. Clockwise. Always start at the end closest to you and look at which way the spiral is going as it travels away from you.
That's how you determine clockwise, counterclockwise. Always. Forget about that looking up above, start at the bottom, should be counterclockwise, and if you're starting at the top going down, it's clockwise. Forget about all that. It's too confusing. Always remember, start at the end closest to you, which way does the spiral go as it travels away from you? Same thing if it's in the pot. The end closest to you, which way the spiral goes as it travels away from you? Okay? I hope this can kind of clear up a lot of the confusion. And just always remember, the face of a clock, as you're looking at it, same with this. Face of a clock, start closest face towards you and travel away. I hope that helps. Uh, if anybody has any problems, feel free to reach out to me. Have a good day.